All right, let's go over to Mike Woods. He is here with kind of a interesting story. I a fellow forecaster. Yes, a fellow forecaster, Corey McCloskey. Uh, something really interesting happened with uh, Corey McCloskey. Now, he's a forecaster out in uh, Phoenix, Arizona, and, you know, things went a little haywire. You know how things go a little crazy with our weather computer here at the station every once in a while? You thought it might be happening to me? Well, take a look at what happened to Corey. Things got very warm over there. Bring you on into the temps, and we're all doing okay. Wow, 750 degrees in Gila Bend right now. <laughs> Uh, and 1,270 uh, in Awatuki. Now, now I, I'm not authorized to <laughs> evacuate Awatuki, but this temperature Creek. seems pretty high. Cave uh, Creek is really Yeah, Cave Creek, Fountain Hills, uh, they don't look good either. <laughs> and frankly, Wickenburg <laughs> is a total loss. <laughs> You gotta love it, Corey. All right, Corey McCloskey now joining us uh, live from Phoenix, Arizona. Corey, nice job, by the way, my friend. My, my weather computer, yeah, oh, everybody right, give you a big round of applause. That video has gone viral. Oh. Something like over a million and a half people have seen that. Now, now first of all, uh, you, 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 the thing, just let folks know what happened there, first of all. I have no idea. Mike, you remember the big z the big zebra mussel scare that you had there a couple of years ago? And oh yeah, uh, everything kind of went went crazy. <laughs> I, I have no idea. I turned around and uh, the no I had about you know a half second to think this is really going to be fun. And, and you uh, did. Sure you had enough. You had a great time with that. So you just kind of went with it, and you're like, yeah, let's just well, let's just do this, right? Well, our show's mostly nonsense. I mean, there's barely any information at all it's that that's a microcosm of uh, what we do every day i mean my job as you might expect uh, doing the weather in phoenix it's uh, it's like early retirement for me i just came out here to relax and that's pretty much uh, what has happened but it's it's been a thrill ride for sure to see all of these views uh, i think on our own website or the fox 10 uh, by the way click it uh, the Fox 10 <laughs> Phoenix uh, Facebook page, I think we're up to about uh, six and a half million wow. views. And it's, I'm getting all kinds of, uh, you know, messages from all over the world. It's really been fun. Now, um, it's interesting when it goes that way. Now, you take someone like Suge Knight, who's, yeah. I think, just misunderstood. Um, <laughs> it could he, be. He's... <laughs> he gets it from the other direction, so I can't imagine what it would be like to have, you know, six million people piling on in a negative way. That wouldn't be, uh, wouldn't be any fun. But wouldn't uh, work for you, anyway, right? Anyway, it's really been a terrific time. You yeah, did an, ex an excellent job. Our computers go haywire here every once in a while, and I actually used to work out there in Phoenix, so I feel the, uh, you know, your pain out there. I know. Things get kind of dry every you know, once in a while. I hope I hope that we're standing united. I think That's it's right. the sports department. Aren't they always in there fooling with oh something? Oh my goodness! Yes, they're, and they're, they're taking shots. I mean, we had this blizzard of 2015. You know what that's been like uh, out here? Yeah. Heard about it? <laughs> Ten inches of snow in the city. Can I ask him a but question? But bear it out east. Go ahead, ask a question. It's Our Juliet. Hey, Juliet. Wants to... Yeah, let Juliet weigh in. So Let's I, start I have a question for you. You know, Mike. Mike. Um, Our window's short. And Mike likes to take his shirt off a oh, lot on, on camera. Now, do you do that as well? <laughs> is that is that a Phoenix? Thing? Did that be? Are you kidding? <laughs> Yesterday was shirtless Thursday. There you what? go. Very so good. Do do? <laughs> oh, I mean, well, <laughs> that probably wouldn't be a good if idea should... if I partook. <laughs> Corey, you're a good sport. I think you, Juliet, I, I must tell you, uh, the ironclad contracts that both Mike and I operate under have a lot of uh, codicils, so to speak, that you wouldn't be familiar with, but uh, hmm. they're pretty rigid. Very well, good. That's that's a shame. That's a shame. But good job. You handled <laughs> nice it great. Nice job. You handled it well. You got a future Thank in comedy, guys. my friend Corey. Thank you for joining <laughs> us and getting up so early. I believe it's like 4:15 in the morning over there. So thank you. I don't know. I weekend. never went to bed. <laughs> don't <laughs> go to guys. bed and make sure you have a good time at the Super Bowl too. Isn't the Super Bowl there? Yeah. 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 Underway. You win. All right. Thank you so much, Corey. Go to Seattle. Us. All right. Better weather on the way. I'm, in fact, it's raining out there in Phoenix today. Can you believe that? Really? Yeah. And that oh, never happens a, either. He's actually earning his right. key. Is it, is it like the storm of the century? <laughs> Probably so. <laughs> a drop of rain is a storm of the century out there. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, our forecast, that's coming right up.